shot shape horse. Let's see a high draw, not a hook. So you gotta factor that in. Oh. <laughs> oh my destiny. Guys, welcome back to another GM Golf video today. I'm back out here at the Lit Range with Micah and Grant. We're doing a fun little challenge today. The rules are quite simple. One of us picks a shot. Let's just say Grant picks a low fade. I get up there, I hit a low fade. It might be a little better than Micah's. Maybe Grant gets up there, hits it even better than both of us. Then both of us get a letter, Micah and I. We both get H. Grant does not get a letter because he hit the best shot for that shot shape, if you will. Basically, once you get to HORSE, like standard force rules, you get knocked out of the challenge. This challenge might go by pretty quick because no matter what, on each shot, two people get a letter. I'm excited to do it again. Let's get into this video, guys. Shot shape horse. Grant's back. Yes, sir. All right, we're gonna flip it to you to see who picks the first shot. Uh, All right, Micah gets, <laughs> Micah gets to pick the first shot. And basically, whoever wins that shot picks the next shot, so on and so forth. Micah, what's the first pick for this horse challenge? All right, I'm gonna go low draw with the seven iron. Okay, low draw. Steven, you wanna judge this shot? The best low draw with the seven iron. So right. lots of pressure on the judge, too. I have eyes of a freaking eagle. I literally see birds running around on the ground 20 miles ahead. <laughs> All right, here we go. Where's the target aiming point? That's the biggest thing. Over the 40 yard marker with a draw. Okay, over the 40 yard marker with a draw. Okay, that, wasn't too low, that was just a little higher than he probably would have liked. It was it was a good draw that though. Was nice, though. It was a draw, but it's right of the 40 and it was super high. It was a little too high, I would say. Yeah. All right, this is giving me flashbacks to the first time you met Kyle and yes. the shot shape challenge. Yeah, yeah, we did. We did like the yardage and shot shape challenge or whatever it was, and I beat Grant by a yard. That was intense. Yeah, that was intense. It was more of a hook than a draw there, Grandy. I have to judge because Tig went too high, but he was a good draw. Yours was low, but a little bit of a hook. Garrett won that one. I'm not gonna lie, that was the best one. The low draw, I ended up taking the dub there. You guys both have H now, both have H's. Yeah. Guys, I picked the next shot shape. You know what we're gonna do, Tig? We're gonna do a high fade, which is completely the opposite of wait, my normal wait, wait, shot wait, shape. Want... Steven's gonna I'm, get in the he video. He starts with the letter. I take it letter, but I wanna participate because I wanna test my strengths. Okay, we're doing a high fade here, Steve. <laughs> Bussin'. <laughs> okay, starting point is the 60 yard marker. Okay, Okay. so it's basically that pin right there. Oh, I don't even know if that counts. Oh, that. That's comparable to Garrett's. What did you say? It was started right, just kind of straight ball flight. Who do we say is the best so far? I mean, mine faded and it started over the sixty, but all right. Oh. That was actually the best ball flight. It just was chunked bad all right grant takes the dub on that one so now grant only has an h i have an h steven ho micah ho yeah now you get to pick the next shot shape. i think we should like change it up and just do like closest to that yellow pin right there Ooh, i kind of like that i like that yeah so, like, carry that. distance carry distance any okay club. any club sign my uh... let's get the yardage let's get the yardage <laughs> what did he say? Mikey here with the with the range. His range time is a little off sometimes. That is not true. It's you're off. 97. All right, Green, you gotta hit it first, my guy. Yeah, Green. A little short. I'll take that though. That was pretty good. Not gonna yeah, lie. A little bad. short, but I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna win it though. All right, here we go. Take up here with the 60 degree. Okay, well, Grant is in the lead. Ready to go? Sure. That's not good. Here you go, Grant. Let's test your steady hands. Oh, wait a second. But is that going to beat Grant? No. Inside of Tig, but outside of Grant. That ain't <laughs> it. <laughs> 58 degrees. <laughs> Dang. He's got it. <laughs> I'm at H, H O R now. Yeah. H O R. H O. H O. Yeah. So this video could go by really fast. The letters I did not expect to go up. I don't know what I was thinking. The rules of this challenge might need to be changed for the next video. 
but I took the dub on that one. Let's see a high draw with a driver. Dude, this is literally my shot tape. Yeah, this is literally Steven's shot tape. Normal swing with the D stick. I All right, got what's it. the target though, Garrett? We're gonna start it over the yellow flag this time. It's a draw, not a hook. So you gotta factor that in. The biggest thing is the high and make sure it moves well. Oh. That's pretty perfect. We'll see, and it started right over the yellow flag, so it's gonna be tough to beat that one. My ball flick, but it's weird. When I actually try and hit a draw, I sometimes can't hit it. Like, it just happens naturally. Grant normally puts his driver right in the slot. Yeah. It's something to behold. Oh, it started a little right, and it was kind of low. Okay. I don't know if it gets better than that, Grant. I mean, I liked it. I thought that was great, but. This is actually Steven's shot. Yeah, I'll just hit it right down the middle. I just went straight, unfortunately. Yeah. Well, that's definitely moving to this way a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Like a foot. You can't be mad. Stripe. You, you should try and hit high draws every time. Maybe that's no, but listen, swing. so who actually won that? Well, I'm winning so far. But yours was... It, it was perfect. Okay, well, Steven beat us all. <laughs> Literally beat us all. That started directly over the yellow pin. Okay, it. It's drawing. That was I, impressive. You know, you know. If, if mine beats Garrett's right now, let me know. I guarantee you it will. No cap. Yours didn't even draw. Yes, it, it is did. started right of the pin. This man is, he's trying to rig the game. All right, no, actually, let's do a poll in the comments. I agree with Micah. The only way to find this out is to ask the comments. But yeah, H O H O R H O R S H O R. Yeah, I just want to do a close to the pin to the orange. Closest to the pin to the orange flag, which is pretty far in the distance. Let's see how far it is. That's the flag. Yeah, 173. The only reason I picked this is because this is all I do at the lit range. I hit it to that target. <laughs> the high draw is perfect for Steve, and this is perfect for Steve. you got to play to your strengths. Oh. Is that your perfect shot, Steve? Shut up. The, Shut up. the club almost hey. went as far as the ball. I'm going to hit an 8-iron. We got 173 is what they said. So That's going to be a full 8-iron, but... I'm gonna juice this one a little bit. You hear that, Tig? I need to win this. You do. Stay in it. Twenty feet. Probably Twenty feet. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Wow, that is really good. Yeah, I'll get that. Tig got me on that one for sure. Can you get the same That's angle? probably like 15. A little stock eight iron. I hope that gets me the win. I mean, maybe Gary will pull out a little hook here or something, but if not, I'm going to be resting in peace. Oh, we got <laughs> little Steve hook. That's unfortunate. I'm at HOR now. Steve's at HORS. Grant is at HORS. Yep. And Mike is at HORS. So. Three way tie at the end, huh? Three way tie all at right. the top of the leaderboard. We all could go out here. That's Other than good, me. Yeah. If I win, yeah, you guys can all get knocked out and I could win. Yeah, we're going to have to make something happen, one of them. Whether you have two or three iron or four iron, it's got to be a stinger that stays below the trees. It can draw or fade. It's just got to stay below the trees. Okay, so that light right there, it has to stay below. I mean, from my angle, that went above the light. No, it was way below it. You want to see the video? Garrett, from down there, obviously it looked like it. That was below the tree line, man. You got to get your eyes checked. All right, Grant up next. It just above the tree line is the highest you can go. Okay. All right, Grant. Grant moves on. I mean, that's going to be tough. I mean, to I hit hit that solid. It's just a two iron has like literally no loss. Wow. I mean, that was solid. Grant was lower at the very end. Grant stayed lower, right? A little lower. Grant's in the lead. I'm currently at HORS. Mike is out, and this is for Steve to stay in. Ah, it's a little higher. That's still good. I mean, those are, those are some solid stingers, though. Steven? Well, I tried. Steven and Tig. Take the L. Grant, wait, this is literally exactly what happened when we played our shot shape challenge with Kyle Berkshire. Yeah, yeah. So Grant picks the last shot. This is for the dub. I'm thinking a low cut with the three ways. I Ooh. like that. A low cut. This is Grant's shot. If you guys have watched the stingers that he hits, anytime he hits a little stinger, it's just always a low cut. All right, so let's go right over this 40 yard marker right here. Low cut. Grant. I don't know if that moved left. Yeah, that just, not good. 
I hit it. I mean, it did move right. Okay, that one cut, but it. Wait, where's the 40? And that oh, could be a we draw. Were going over the 40. I. That's my bad. No, no, no. I actually, for some reason, I wasn't paying attention. So here's the deal. Here's the deal, guys. We're doing a playoff because mine was left of the 40. Grant's was over the 40. He didn't hit it as good. It didn't cut as much. Yeah. So, what's the playoff? Same thing? Let's do the same thing. Same thing, over the 40 again. It's easy to go under it with a shallow face like this. So you really got to pick it solid. Mm. Is that what it is? <laughs> okay. Oh, that, that's going to be tough to beat. Because that stayed, I mean, that was just above the tree line. I like that one. That was pretty sick. Like, low. Mm. I got to keep this low. Dude, that was almost identical, though. Dude, I gotta be honest, I think Garrett's stayed a little bit lower. But, was mine better? I don't know, hey, let's actually do this. Let's do this, since we can't decide, let's just have the comments decide. Okay, we've had a good match up until this point. We hit very similar shots there, so let's get you guys involved. Comment down below and the top comment, either Garrett's one or Grant's one. I love it. That's the winner. Get the people deciding. I love it. I love it. Anyways, guys, Shot Shape Horse, it's actually a really fun game to play with your friends. So if you guys go to the range, you have a group of friends that all play golf, you want to improve your shot shaping ability, maybe put some pressure on the line, do like losers have to jump to the pond or something like, I don't know. Whatever you want to do, I think it's really good to train your ability to shot shape. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, stay tuned for more videos in the future. Until next time, guys, peace.